Well, if you're spooked by the chill of fall in the air, but don't mind Halloween, the Maple Grove Art Center has just the show for you. In Weekend Showcase, Neil Persley explains how it helps feed your pension for poltergeists. We have our monster show on at the moment, which is full of wonderful, frightful, sinister art from local artists. The monster show at Maple Grove Art Center features lots of creepy pieces, but it's also the setting this year for the center's annual fundraiser. It's our masquerade gala. So we're having the two amalgamated in one. It's $5 to come in and we'll have wine and appetizers. We're encouraging people to wear costumes. If they want to wear a mask, that would be great. We'll have a costume uh, contest and prizes. And uh, we will also have a silent auction. So there'll be all sorts of wonderful prizes. From whimsical to wicked, it's a creepy cavalcade of interesting pieces. Everyone has a different bent on what is creepy, you know? Some people it might just be a strange looking dark face. Some people it's all out monsters. From acrylic to pencil, mixed media, and everything in between, I'll bet you find something you could get into. We have a wonderful doll's house here, which takes Spooky to a whole new level, which is full of all sorts of eerie things going on inside it. The Masquerade Gala is going to be on Friday night, October 27th at 6.30 p.m. That's the weekend before Halloween. So if you'd like to come out and support the arts in Maple Grove, I think this is going to be a lot of fun. From the Maple Grove Arts Center in Maple Grove, Neil Persley, CCX News. Hey. Hey! hey don't... If you can make it to the Maple Grove Arts Center's Masquerade Gala, the gallery is open most days and it is free to tour. For details, you can visit maplegroveartscenter.org. And Neil is and still Neil. stuck in He's that great. house. He's great. we got to go get him. <laughs> got to get help there.